Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial. This tutorial is for Microsoft Visual Basic 6. It will be showing you how to make a basic web browser. Okay, so we're going to start off with the standard EXE. There's our form. We're going to make the border style fix single. Okay. Now we're going to make the form as big as possible. So actually you're going to change it from fixed single to sizable again. Make it as big as possible. So press the maximize button on it and change it to fixed single. There we go with that. Actually no. You're going to want to keep it sizable. It's better if it's sizable. Okay. So first thing we're going to want to add want to add is probably a text box so people can type in where the web address is going to be so you're going to want a text box and a button okay and then you're going to also want to add a component so right click on your toolbar thing add a component and then go to uh, Microsoft I think I haven't done this in a long time so Pretty sure it's a uh, Microsoft Internet Controls. Let's try that. Yeah, Microsoft Internet Controls is the thing you need. So make that. Then you're gonna want to click it, make it as big as possible, pretty much. Just like resize it so it's the whole form. Yeah. Okay. make the top a little bit smaller. Now, we're going to want to make it. So this button right here says go. So like when I click on it, it says go. Okay. The caption for this text, clear it. And then you're going to want a couple buttons like back, forward, stop, refresh, home, Back for us, I'll refresh home. I think that's it. Make them all the same size. Whoops. Make them all the same size. Make them all lined up right next to each other. Okay. <sighs> this might take a while. Do -do -do, do -do -do. There we go. And that's pretty much that. So, we're going to want to make it. So, one, you could type in the web browser thing. So, double click on the go button to type in the code. And the code for the web browser is web browser one dot navigate text one dot text. And that pretty much just navigates it to where text one dot text is. Okay, I'm gonna make the form again. Now we're going to make it so when the form loads, the web browser loads to like a home page. So double click on your form and make uh navigate or web browser one dot navigate two. So you want it to be Google, so w w actually let's make it YouTube youtube.com okay there we go so now we make the back buttons and everything so double click on your first button make web browser one dot go back pretty easy probably want to gonna change the captions on all these back uh, forward Stop. Refresh. And, uh, home. Should probably be capitalized to make it look cool. Okay, looks good. Now, 
Okay. Looks good, looks good. And we're gonna make the forward button, so web browser one dot go forward. Stop button. Web browser one dot go stop. No wait, no, stop. Yeah, just stop. Not go stop. Okay. Refresh button. Web browser one dot refresh. And home button. Web browser one dot go home. That's pretty much your basics. I'm going to also uh, have another video where it's going to show like how to make it really fancy. So this is just the basics. So you have this so far, and then you run the program. Get this. It automatically opens up on YouTube. You type in like www.google.google.com. Hit go. And you're at Google. So it works so far. Mix that out so we can type in some more code here. Um, let me try to get my camera back to the cool thing. Okay. So now you're going to want to make it so you're able to um, press enter to make it navigate because normally if you press enter it's not going to navigate. So click on the code thing or double click on your go button make it command 1 key press then you're going to want to make if key press vb pretty sure this is the code return no wait no Okay, you know, I'm going to import the code from another project I had because I forgot the code. So, hold on one second.